we call it cutting. It isn't exactly that. Uh, cutting implies severing something. It really should be called assembly. Mosaic is assembling something to create a whole. Uh, montage means the assembly of pieces of film which moved in rapid succession before the eye create an idea. Uh, of course, the most elementary form is the uh, juxtaposition of imagery uh, in various sizes. You know, a lot of people think that cutting is, uh, or we'll say montage or assembly, is taking a man from one place to another and jumping into a close-up of him, which Griffith invented, it's true. But um, to me, it goes much deeper. And as I say, the, the picture psycho contained quite an amount of cinematic approach to this, to, to its basic content. In the first place, we had in it the murder of a woman in a shower, of a nude woman. Now, as you know, you could not take the camera and just show a nude woman being stabbed to death. It had to be done impressionistically. So it was done with little pieces of film, the head, the feet, the hand, the parts of the torso, Shadow on the curtain. Everything, you see, was you the shower itself. I think in that scene there were 78 pieces of film in about 45 seconds. Now, that's one kind. Now, we'll take another kind, which I would prefer to call, say, the orchestration. Loud notes, soft notes, and so forth. The second murder in Psycho was treated quite differently. It showed a detective coming up the stairs, the audience already aware that a monster was around. So they were apprehensive for him, but they didn't know when it was going to happen. So I have this man mounting the stairs in what we would call a medium shot, a waste shot. And he gets to the top of the stairs. Then I take the camera and put it very, very high, way, way high, above the ceiling almost as though we're looking down on the whole thing. And a little figure runs out with a raised knife. And the, and the hand goes up with the knife into the air and brings it, starts to bring it down. Now remember, these are two tiny figures. 
then the next cut is a big head of the man as the knife goes across his face. Now, this is size of image put together to create shock. In other words, if it were music, it would be tremolos on the violin and suddenly a brass instrument, which is the big close-up. And from that he fell and went back. So there's an illustration of using the size of the, of the image to create shock or whatever you will. Now the third way is what one might call pure cinematics, the assembly of, of film and how it can be changed to create a different idea. Now we have a close up. Let me show what he sees. Let's assume he saw a woman holding a baby in her arms. Now we cut back to his reaction to what he sees. And he smiles. Now what is he as a character? He's a kindly man. He's sympathetic. Now, let's take the middle piece of film away, the woman with the child, but leave his two pieces of film as they were. Now we'll put in uh, a piece of film of a girl in a bikini. He looks, girl in a bikini, he smiles. What is he now? The dirty old man. He's no longer the benign gentleman who loves babies. That's the difference. That's what film can do for you. Or you for it, as it were. <laughs>